Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy Time back with another video and today we're going to be discussing whether or not it is worth it to use confirm edit on release in Fortnite season 8. Alright, first things first, if you don't know what confirm edit on release is, it is right here in your settings options on the second tab. See, I have mine off. I recently had it on. If you saw my last settings video, I was using it, but I've currently decided to switch off and I'm going to tell you guys why I did that in this video. Alright, I'm going to just turn it on for right now to show you guys what it is. So right now, as you can see, my confirm button is B. It's my paddle, but... All I'm going to do is select, and as soon as I let go of my select button, it's going to edit for me. Hey, like, I don't know if you can hear my controller, but you can hear the difference. Like, Listen to that, and then I'm going to turn it on, or turn it off. And now listen to it. I have to tap that confirm button to finish the edit every time. And I literally switched off of confirm edit on release literally yesterday, so I'm still not that good with confirming yet, but <coughs> I'm getting better. I also just recently switched to Exponential. If you saw my second video, you would have seen that. One reason that I switched off of Confirm Edit on Release, it wasn't really a big reason, like, it wasn't a, a main contributor, but if you can master confirming and using two binds to edit like I do like I edit with uh, my one paddle and I confirm with another a, a different one then you'll be able to edit way faster than confirm edit on release confirm edit on release also takes a lot longer to master because the timing you have to get that down very precise if you want to be very fast with it okay and now for the big main reason that i switched off of confirm edit on release is here let me turn it on again though so i can show you guys this so when you are going for a right hand peak with confirm edit on release you're gonna edit it and then you're gonna have to move after you edit it unless you're holding it down which most people when they edit it when they go like that their head is peaking right here. The right hand peak. So you gotta go like that and then get out of the way. See, like, just like this. Just, this is the perfect example. See, like that, how I'm jumping and, like, when I confirm the edit, if I come right here and confirm the edit, like, say I'm on a stair like this. I come over here to confirm it. And I just release this it's gonna show my head right here as I'm trying to get to the corner but if I have it if I have the setting turned off fuck I just did the wrong setting if I turn the setting off I can then get out of the way and then confirm it so I'm right here just like this like with the window get out of the way and then confirm it I can move the whole way over here and then edit things I can move the whole way over here and do this but when you have it on if you go like this you have to hold your um, select button to be able to not confirm the edit so if you move it's gonna select these other tiles so that's a big reason why I switched off to have way better right hand peaks and way better angles while fighting somebody. Alright, well, I'm not saying that confirm edit on release is bad and that you shouldn't use it 
some people find that it's really good and if you're already used to it i wouldn't say switch off i switched off because i used to use a confirmed bind so it's really not that hard for me to get used to but yeah that's really it guys i just want to make this quick and simple so you guys can get the point i can get the point across quick and you guys can learn quickly so yeah and yeah that is what my point of view on the edit on release debate um i'm personally not using it anymore but i also don't think that it's bad and that you shouldn't use it i think if you're already using it there's no point of switching off but as i said in the video if you play comp and the right hand piece mean a lot to you and you think it will make your game a lot better you can switch off it's really up to you it's really opinion but yeah uh hope you guys enjoyed um like the video if you did comment subscribe i'm out peace